Greetings, fellow prospectors. Matt Stone here, and welcome back to Icarus, season one, episode number eight. I don't know if you heard the ominous lightning thunder in the background, but we are. We have, we have a flash storm. They call it a flash storm coming up on us. Let's get our grid back up here. Yeah, get that storm coming through. It'll be interesting to see what happens. This will be our first. We've had a windstorm, we've had rainstorm. It'll be interesting to see what happens. Ooh, yeah. Probably gonna want to make a couple extra lightning rods just for looks. Right now I got one on each end of the building. Or one on each end, I think. Let's see. Well, oh, maybe not. Oh, I got them on this building. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Because I hadn't built the other one yet. <laughs> so. Well, we'll see. So, what did I do during the break? Uh, went ahead and figured out how I wanted to handle the living area. And this included, let's go ahead and walk over there. This included reducing the size to a five by six. So I could center the fireplace. I just felt it was a little too big to try to fill. Because we've got plenty of room for a whole kitchen here. Kind of a dining, I'm calling it a dining area. Whatever else we might kind of put it there. A little living area here. And then our living, I'm sorry, our bedroom over here. And I went with the double windows. We can upgrade them over time with glass and other stuff. But the idea here, from the kitchen, I can check out the garden that will be out here eventually. Man. Got another another batch coming through here in a second. This one had like three red, red sections in it. I had to get back on the ladder again for our fireplaces. <laughs> so again, so yeah, I basically pulled this back one layer. This makes the farming area bigger, which is fine. I might even do the same thing on the workshop. I don't know yet. I'm, I'm adjusting to the feel of the size of the building. So what we'll do today, we're going to do a little bit of uh, work here in the building. Some trees getting hit over there, yeah. Not too bad. But like I said, eventually we're going to build this out. Uh, probably three to four. So it gets to the water edge so we can fish. But that'll be down the road. Maybe. Yeah, I'd like to get a real bed eventually. Um, so yeah, we got a two fires. So this one will mostly be for cooking. I just, I just had them lit just so y'all could see them. And this one will be for the living side. So I figure we'll have like a little sitting area here. Who knows what I'll end up doing here. Play around with all the furniture. But yeah, I may go ahead and push even this one back. I got different ideas going over here. The more that, you know, it's, it's big. So maybe I pull it back also. So that we have more room for garden farming. Quite a bit of stuff we can put in here once we enclose it with the greenhouse. But I also think I'm going to end up even like taking some of this and opening it up and turning it into an open air because I think some of the newer furnaces and stuff re are required to be out outside. So I'm not 100%. And again, we'll play it by ear. But I left room here that we could push out if we need to. So that's not a problem either. I do need to make sure though that we, well, we got to have a path, minimal path to get through with the mounts since I think that's going to be the best spot back here eventually for a stable. All right. So let's go see about temporarily or let's move our kitchen over. And while we're at it, let me think about this. Let's go into craft. Let's unlock the fridge. Let's see if we can get one of those built. Sure we're missing something. Probably iron. Oh, copper nails and wood. Okay, that's not too difficult. We got wow. Why did I make so many copper? I don't know. <laughs> that might have been an accident, but we'll go ahead. Well, I know I've been using them to make cabinets, and we will be making a lot of cabinets. So. Let's grab a stack of wood. 
get that in there. So while we're doing the other stuff, we can get a fridge made. Perfect fridge. We already have some of the other cooking benches here. How much room do I have? Because we got to take everything out of them. Oh, that one's going to be difficult. We got a lot of stuff in there. Let's start with this stuff. Okay, I'm going to put it over here, kind of in my seed bin. Uh, let's see. Kind of where I was throwing stuff anyway. Salt. Oh, yeah, let me put this stuff up. Go ahead and do add to stack. Add to stacks. There we go. Oh, charcoal. Well, we got to pull this stuff apart anyway. Okay, take all. Break this one down. I'm sure there'll be several changes as I play around with the different cooking benches and how to place them. I'm going to take one of these. So we'll come back here in a minute. We are going to put this setup over in the kitchen because it does. We'll end up with one of these on each side. Because some of the stuff we need for the kitchen and some of it we need for cooking and some of it we need for the obviously other crafting stuff. So this is going to be our main deal. I think for now, I have the feeling like I want to be able to look out while I'm cooking. This will all change, I'm sure, a dozen times as we unlock more stuff. I'm kind of going with that look. Because later on we can build actual cabinets and stuff. Okay, so we're going to get the fridge over there. Let's dump all the fat. Fire's still burning over there. Yeah, let's get all the fat in there. Now for now, maybe like this. Yep, and then we can fill it up with ice, which we will be getting today. And then we're going to go ahead and grab at least one of these cabinets. Probably grab two for now. Let's go back in here. We'll do a take all almost. And maybe for now, I'll throw the bone. There's a room in here. Yeah. So we'll go ahead and add to stack. What else do I got? I think the, well, the wheat can go with us eventually. Oh, the crush bone. Let me think about that. Organize this. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to throw the crushed bone here and the sap. I'll try to remember this stuff. Okay. I'm trying to think what I need for cooking versus what I need for, you know, other stuff. Okay. Then we can get the rest of this. Definitely that. If the poison doesn't go with us. But we could do some chemistry work next door. Got all our flowers, more sap. And we got a lot of sap. Okay. Yep. That's why I, just, I gotta start getting organized here. Okay. Oh. It'll be a little mixed up. Can I get this now? No. So you can take all. Oh, we did. Just can't carry the bench. Okay. Any room left here? Okay, at least we got that. Okay. And get our herbalism bench. I think. Now, do we use this for. I think we need this for making dough or something. So we'll put one on each side. Or we'll have one. I guess I could have just made two new ones. But I'm going to take that fireplace out. We don't really need one over here. We're not in a cold environment. Okay, so for now... Oh, 
little spot for putting our stuff. Probably do our herbalism over here for now. Again, it's going to change. Oh, in fact, we're going to put our... Oh, I'll leave it over there for now. Okay. Right, do I have anything that goes... Let's go over in the bottom here. I think that goes in there, that goes in there, that goes in the top. We can put this. Because now we can make flour. And let's see. Oh, that needs to go in a different spot. Put top bowl. Just for now. I said stuff will get moved several times. Looks good. In the bottom, I know we use charcoal. I had this for probably making other stuff, but we're going to need that in here for now for oxygen. I got to start keeping an eye on that. Where is our tank? Oh, we're doing good now. We might as well swap it out. All right, looking good. Let me look back here. Stuff that I want to keep in the kitchen. I mean, I think we'll do herbalism over there for now. We'll see. I probably don't need all this right away. And we know where it is if we need it later. These are all our seeds. Yeah, let's not get crazy. Put the seeds over here for now. Except for these. Okay. Use those for making food. Okay. So for now, got our bees, honey, seeds. Throw that in here. The extra cabinet. I don't think we need the second cabinet, do we? For now. Why not? Just keep it. We'll grow into it. Or we'll move it. Okay. What else was I working on? Why do I have all these? Was I gonna Oh, I was looking at the framing in here. I think everything's okay. I think I was going to do some uh, cosmetic framing. I thought now that I got how I wanted it. Kind of like, oop. Well, I got to think about that, though, because if I'm going to put glass in. Hmm. Maybe I'll leave it like that. We'll see. Again, I can always change it. Just trying to provide proper support. We don't want anything collapsing on us. All right. Let's put this back away. What time is it? All right. 10 o'clock. Yeah. I think we're good. So we'll get some sleep. We keep ending up with more and more raw meat. Oh, did I leave food in here? Yep, okay. I'll leave the charcoal now. Might as well take that out. We'll put it somewhere. No firewood left. No in there. Oh, here we go. Here's charcoal. Not exactly where it's supposed to be in the end. Okay, so we're going to go do a little expedition here in the morning. We're going to go to the snow area. I want to get my hands on some, you know, these poor T-bone stuff. They're just going to spoil. I don't know how much use for them right now. So it sticks in there. Make more sap later. Okay. Everything's clean here. It must be close to midnight. They play that spooky music when it gets late. 
telling you, man, you need to go to bed. Where'd I put the sickle? Uh, I know I got the idea yet, yeah, right here. I'm starting to get some muscle memory of where I've been putting stuff. Uh, let's top off the arrows. And we need the shovel. Yeah, we need the shovel. In fact, we'll need the shovel here for now. Guess I'll repair it. So we got a couple things to do. Let's go get. We'll get this the uh, ice. That'll be a short trip. It'll be over by that mining cave, and then we're gonna go up north, like I said yesterday, or last episode. Sorry. Well, yeah, we'll run down here and get some snow. We don't have to go very far. We might even take a poke around. There might be a bear though. I gotta be careful. There's polar bears over here, so we might have to be real careful. But that would probably be the easiest place to get ice right now. Get the fridge going so we can start keeping stuff longer. It'll slow down the stuff going bad. Let's go over to our new living area. So because I couldn't remember, because, you know, I played uh, Valheim for a long time, and I just knew Valheim, the bed had to be, like, right next to the fire, real close. I actually turned this fire on and put the bed here, and it still worked. So this is more out of uh, cosmetics than nece you know, necessity. You could go with just one fireplace, it looks like. That's all we care about. And we do have our, yeah, we do have our spawn set. We're going to eat some food. Let's go ahead and set our buffs. Got our arrows, our bow, and everything's in good shape. All right, let's hit the road. Try to conserve a little energy here and there. So we're going this way again. We'll put a marker down for the snow area. All right. Eventually, I'm going to have to work on those. Yeah. Get a nice early start in the morning. Just go ahead and head to the... Uh... Oh, there's some corn. I got to remember that. <laughs> we can make that corn mush meal, whatever it was. So this is going to take us past the cave. For now, that cave is pretty done until we're ready to go in there with the aluminum and some other stuff. We've unlocked steel, so we could start making, I could, yeah, but I need to get a big, big rush on getting a big score on some more iron, copper, you know, go ahead and start really getting cabinets full, start getting the crafting assembly line set up over there in the workshop. So now that we've pulled out the kitchen stuff, oh, he's right there. That's the K. That's how I miss it because I, a lot of times I get distracted by the creatures. Early morning, all the animals are out and about. Yeah, we're not ready to take on a polar bear. I don't know why I do that. Why do I pick that stuff up all the time? Yep, yep, I see you, buddy. Oh, here's some more wheat. There'll be a time for that, too. Okay, we should be getting close. Yep. This is the valley that leads into the snow area. So we'll keep our ears open. We got our shovel on number seven. Okay. Nice, cool morning. Is that snow? That's snow right there. Yeah, that's snow. I think there might be a cave right No, I don't think so. Ooh, there we go. What is that? Sulfur? Did the note. Got a sulfur node. We could set up a deep ore on there. Oh, maybe I'll grab some salt. I keep forgetting salt. Yeah, because we already went through a lot of what we had.
But now between the salt and the, the preserving in the refrigerator, should be able to help some of our stuff last a lot longer. Now there is an item in the uh, cold area that we can't get anywhere else. That's mushrooms. Okay, that's a bear. That might be a polar bear. That's not, that's a horse. But the, the, the noise I just heard. <laughs> now hopefully he's... There's a horse right there. Is that the... Let's go over here. So oh, he's over there somewhere. I just heard him. Yeah. Don't want to get killed by a polar bear. We just need enough snow to dig in. Might be able to make this work. Let's see. Okay, we're getting nice. It's a lot easier than it used to be. I remember you used to have... Oh, there he is right there. Look at him. Yeah. So he's out of our way a little bit. Okay. Yeah, you used to have to pick up the snow one piece at a time. We got a hundred. I think I'm going to get a little more. I think now it'll... Uh, we can kind of put some of it in the actual refrigerator. Or ice box, we should say. So we'll go to 200. Uh, a little more. There we go. All right, let's get out of here. All right. Now our way back, we've got plenty of carry space. That stuff stacks in hundreds. Let me keep an eye out for wheat. Wheat's good because it doesn't spoil. So we could pick up a little bit of that. I'm trying to hold off on grabbing other vegetables and fruits until I'm ready for them. Oh, 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 oh. They're just, man, they just don't. They don't like being disturbed. I don't want to kill them. I like horses. Okay. They should be a little more like the wolves where they just kind of give you a little, hey, get away from me. Okay, we're going to change the shovel out. There we go. To our sickle, that way we can grab up some wheat maybe or whatever else I find on the way back I hear a wolf he's down here somewhere he's down there oh actually yeah we're not even we're still in the snow area there he is oops sun's rising oh I could have stabbed him in the head. Okay. Another wolf. It's been the last two episodes. Wolves everywhere. Really got him riled up out here. I see wheat to the left. So we'll go hit some of that up. Yeah, there's some right there. Let's get it. There we go. Get the sickle out. Takes quite a bit to make the dough. Boy, it's a pretty, pretty efficient plant, too. We're getting quite a bit here. Yeah. I may go to a thousand. A lot. It takes a lot to make the dough. I don't remember the numbers, but it seemed like every time I think, oh, man, I'm good for 
you know, I'll maybe I'll make a whole bakery worth of stuff and it'd be like, no. Oh, we're full. Holy crap. Is it not stacked to a hundred? It does. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight. Oh, okay. All right, we're done. We got to get out of here. We are full. Let's try to stay. There's a wolf over here on the left. I'm full right now. I don't want to waste the meat. Hang on. Let's look at our salt. We only got 47. I think it stacks to a hundred. There we go. A little more salt. We got that health concoction. I still haven't made one yet. Check the map. Uh, okay, yeah. Thought, thought, thought. Should be close. Should see water here in a second. Yeah, there we go. So I need to learn to go. See, I don't know if these animals are up here or down at the house. I hear a horse. Oh, he's right here. So I probably need to stay up on the ridge for now. Let's follow the ridge all the way over. Until, yeah. Look. Up here. And then we can cut across to the bridge. Make me a sign up there somewhere. Turn here, make a little right, or turn left. <laughs> I got a wolf out on the island. Right there. Okay. Oh. Let's head to the kitchen. Gotta get used to the layout. Okay, we'll get the salt out of our inventory. Oh, let's go oh, straight to the fridge. Get that ice in the bottom. There we go. Hopefully this will not melt fast. Basically, we're cooling our ice. So now I can start throwing meat and stuff in here. Now it should slow down. Uh, 37 minutes until spoiled, 29 minutes. Six minutes to the first layer. Yeah, so, boy, that's a big jump. Okay, good. And that's the first, you remember, this spoils and layers, so. Because I'm good on the meat right now, so. Now this has 2.6 hours. So that's after I salted it. Oh, I see. Okay, now what happens if I do this? 15, oh, wow. Oh, hang on, guys, okay. Oh, yep. <laughs> Gotta remember, we moved. Let's go ahead and grab this. And for now, since we don't actually have a uh, the wolf's getting close, maybe. Since we don't actually have a garden yet, let's just put this here. I want to dry that. Okay. Go ahead and dry that. Okay, let's go ahead. We're going to salt up that. So we got 19. So now I'm going to split that. That way I don't waste as much. I think I'll salt. I'm going to start salting a little. I'm not going to salt everything. But seeing how much... When you combine those two together... Yeah, that's a lot of time. I mean, that's 15.4 hours. Eight, 16 out. Yeah, that's good. That's very, very... Better than I ever thought. Crackers are okay. We make those ourselves. Okay, let's go over to the... 
guy here, dump all the flour in there, I'll dump you in there. You in there. We're gonna go ahead and max that out. Yeah, see all that? I get 80. <laughs> so, no big deal. Got more seeds. Oh, actually, the seeds will go in here. We're making crackers. Oh, these are wheat seeds. I'll put them down there for now. Okay. So I had some other seeds. Yeah, I had oh, it's fiber. These are these are actually wheat. Yeah. We might want to plant those. But man, we got wheat so easy to get right now. Well, let's let's be smart about it though. We might still need that. Don't leave that one empty until I get organized. So let's put you over here for now, temporarily. Dirt. It's kind of a crafting material still. Where's that wolf at? Oh, he's trying to get up. Oh. He's trying to get into the house. All right, buddy. Sorry, buddy. We got some points. We need, we need to level up some more. Just a few more points here and there. Okay. That sounds like we got a horse somewhere nearby. That dirt in there for now. Ooh, we're getting full on leather. So what I'm going to do with some of this leather. One, two, three, four. We're going to go over to our... Leather bench here, whatever you want to call. And we're going to queue up some rope. Max that out. That's a horse. Oh, crap. Jeez. He's going to tear this house up. Oh, oh, I can't get back up. <laughs> I gotta put some stairs over here. Here he comes. Whoa. Man. Yeah, these guys are just annoying. Annoying. I need to try to, yeah, I need to make that deterrent. There's a deterrent supposed to keep these guys from. Now they'll naturally come here though, if they're still coming here for food and water. How's our door looking? Uh, I have to get a hammer for that. I think we're okay. Just got all my inventory cleaned out. I gotta go back here, add to stacks, add to stacks. Just drop the rock in here that I keep picking up. that in there okay another storm was it, I didn't even look to see what kind of was it looks like oh, it's wind okay I'll go ahead and do that I think everything else is good got another oh a little more of that. so 400 is the stack on seeds Water, we need to refuel our lantern. I'm gonna put the shovel down back in here. Are we out of fat? Oh, we are. Hang on. I've been going crazy over here reloading this thing. Grab another stack or two. Let's grab two more. Well, at least it's easy to produce. Put you back in here. Right click repair. Good on everything. I don't 
no, I hate to waste all that material. That's just bone. And that's bone. Got another freaking wolf. The other one on the island too? You guys aren't gonna let me get out of here. Oh, I gotta wait for the storm anyway. What time is it? 12 noon? Okay. Let's go inside while waiting. Uh, what did I pick up? All the usuals. Empty that out. I don't really want to have a spot for spoiling food, do I? He'll go in here for now. It'll just spoil. Okay. <laughs> what was I trying to do? We're going to go farming. I mean, no, I'm sorry. We're going to go up north, looking for some caves. There's some small ones I know. There's uh, around the... There's one here. As far as I know, we emptied that one. So we'll go straight to here. Did, did we? Man, I don't remember. So we'll probably go up here first. Check it. Oh, I'm out of water. Hang on. Uh, yeah. oh, I hear you. And we need a little food. Okay. We have no buffs. They're all about to run out. There we go. Okay. I think we're actually things are moving along faster than I expected. Um, so I think just needs because again some of the stuff didn't exist when I played before. But I think we may already be ready to start putting down a dang uh, start working on mounts because I'm just thinking we need a mount to move around and to carry more stuff. So I won't do it this episode, but next episode I think we're going to go ahead and put down a uh, get a stable going because I want to sketch something up between episodes but we're gonna keep moving on the storm should be letting up in just a little bit i'm gonna check here too hard farming or medium loss locate the an abandoned base see that one i know if i remember you find the building then they want you to repair it and then while you're repairing it you get attacked by a bunch of animals now we could do hard farming Let's just, it just depends on what what they want us to grow. Oh, corn. Oh, hang on. Now, there's a loophole on this in that you don't actually have to farm it. You just have to provide it. And we got a sickle. And we know where there's a stash of corn. As we saw it earlier. And you got to look on the ground. Uh, see, it's right here already. So besides uh, picking up what you can, you can, I mean, besides what you can use off the plants, and we only needed, what, 31? We're already at 22. But like I say, look on the ground, because there's a lot of it just laying there. Okay, 32. And let's grab a little extra... 34, 37, is that a horse, it is, you like, you probably like corn, don't you, all right, let's go back, let's avoid that guy, now where did the, where did it land, let me look real quick, I think we can go the other way, maybe. Proghorn. Game meat. Oh, he saw me. 
starting to see where that third bridge might be a necessity. I don't know. It'd be a lot bigger than the other two, you know, going across there. Maybe I have to look at it. When we build the, uh, we'll put that on next episode. We'll make a decision when we build the, uh, stable. I think I want to play around with the new dirt plots with the stable so we can have like a dirt bottom on it. Foundation. I haven't really used that stuff too much. Okay, now what was it? 32 out of 46. Oh, maybe it does have to be Row and deliver. Oh, I can't break the loophole. Hang on. <laughs> they caught me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, what? Right there, guys. Oh, but that just gets me on this. I was going to say, yeah, under this little island. Now, no. Oh, you know what? Nah. I'm almost thinking this is all part of building fun of course clear off this little island because it's surrounded by water and we got the waterfall right there we clean this off and make it into a little gazebo type thing with a bridge that just takes us back over to the yeah just right across here I know oh, I saw the, oh I got what the hell I must have tried to build something over here. <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, it might have been one of the original base. Yeah, the directions. I, I couldn't. Yeah, the, the episode that didn't air. I had started building this way and found out it was the building was too long and it was, I was running into stuff. Yep, 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 yep. But yeah, maybe. And this would be more a smaller bridge. But I don't think I can make one any skinnier other than a pedestrian. But that might be cool. Have a little spot there. We can overlook the waterfall. I mean, we're going to be living here for a while. Yeah. Got him. Okay. Let's pick him up. And that reminds me, I got to put stairs over here. Yeah. Got to get some stairs. But we're not going to build any more bridges right now. I guess I could go ahead and invest in a skinning bench, too. But we need to go mining. So I have the ability, so hang on. Yeah, let's think about this. What time is it? Yeah, we got time. Skin him. Got to get him skinned. And I might have enough material... do basic planting I'd already made a plot and I stuck it in the cabinet somewhere but we can make these so what if I make do okay, we need more dirt dirt's not a problem shovel switch the shovel out let's go ahead and do this let's go ahead and get a basic farming set up I've been wanting to play with that anyway no time like the present Well, in fact, I don't even need to make the... We can go really laid back. Let me show you guys this. So right off the bat, you don't even need to build anything fancy. Okay, we're going to go... See how we have a right click says dirt mound? Yeah, let's do that right over here. No, wait, let's do it out here in the sun. I'm trying to think. How about over here? little farming area one two three four five six uh, hang on I need to look when we did that corn we got 17 okay six well, we'll try eight so these are basically little plots and we're gonna use those yeah I'm not even gonna worry about breaking out let's start with Tier one farming, we'll call it. 
So let's go ahead and put this stuff back. Put the dirt in here for later. I might use it for building. Let's put the shovel back. It needs to be repaired already. Wow. Um, we'll clear all this out in a minute. What I want to look at is I need a watering can, I'm assuming. I don't really understand what the differences might be. Well, this would be strictly for plants. Let's go ahead and get one of those. And let's see what's the material for that. It's in this bench, right? Yeah, it's tier two. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. It's probably here. Sorry. I forget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We have stuff. Okay, so I'm going to put that... Number seven is kind of my utility slot, so. so let's go get that thing full of water. I don't think it has to be. Oh, not drink. You idiot. Uh, oh, well. We got sick right away. <laughs> Good job, Matt. All right, let's put the uh, seeds in our hand. Let's put those here for now. Let's go to eight. Oh, these are kind of big, aren't they? Then we're going to go back. It should be now we can water. Yep. Whoa. Holy smokes. Okay. Now, if a storm comes through here, they could die. That's our only gamble, not having a greenhouse and all that. Oh, there's the little thing on the side. So we got water. It doesn't look like it changes. All right. Well, we'll let that see what happens. Good time to learn. Do I have room in here? It's kind of my farming slash miscellaneous. Put you down there. Here, dump that. Go here, dump whatever. Here, we can put that in that. All those two. Oh, actually, I'm going to keep these with me. Do I still have? Yeah, I don't have my other ones that I normally have. I ended up with a ton of corn. Didn't mean to pick all that corn. So, what we'll do. What was that meal? Right here, cream corn, 150 health, 75 stam. So that's a good one, actually. So let's do like five of those. Because what was this one? This was stam. What am I missing here? So this one's actually low, but the melee attack speed. So really, this should be kind of, okay, I see. I'm not growing that one. Other than, like I said, let's go to six, seven, eight. Okay, we'll get those going. I'm going to put the rest of the corn in the fridge. I don't know if I can salt. Well, that's a lot of salt. It would be 38 salt. We'll just slow down. 20-something minutes. That's good. Did it finish already? Oh, I took the corn out of my inventory before it finished. Goofus. Wait. This should have pulled it. No, what did it do? It's. Oh, I'm confused. It should have made the corn. Shouldn't have anything to do with me. Oh, requires water. It was feed. Oh, it took my. Uh, it took my thing out of my inventory. Ah. Not wasn't paying attention. Okay. Oh, not 10. Oh, I kicked the wrong thing again. So that might be the water bucket. Get the water bucket, fill it with water, and leave it in here. Okay. Learn something new, guys. Okay, we'll refill those. More corns. Oh, those are the corn seeds. Okay. I am going to salt this so it lasts longer. 
And then we'll put the seeds. I mean, I'll put the corn in here. Let it last as long as it can. Some raw meat. I'm going to hold this stuff. And I'm starting to think I can get away with one water. Put the seeds over here. I'm going to move the gardening stuff eventually into the kitchen area. But for now, put that in there. Yeah, I'm trying to decide if I need to carry two waters with me. That one filled. Swap them out. And we'll let me swap that way. Here, put you in here. All right, we're good. We're clean. We're clear. All our buffs. We just got. To, we're stuck with this right now. All right. Let's set a goal. Going up here. Oh, yeah, I'm going there. That's right. Uh, so we'll go across the bridge. Let's go farm. I'm sorry. Let's go get some. I was looking to see. They look like they're growing. Yeah, let's go. Let's go get some ore. Get that bow out. All right. So we got to go. You know, we'll check out this little... I'm pretty sure we cleaned out this lower level mine earlier. But it, it's on the way. So we can take a peek inside. Of course, this might have been the one I only took the basics out of. Oh, it's already 17. Man, I lose track of time. It's gold, right? Oh, let's... Hang on. Oh, we got iron and copper. Okay. Man, there's... Oh, yeah, okay. Take my arrow back. Yeah, we're good. Okay. It's perfect with the amount of time we have left. Uh, sunlight, that is, yeah. Broke that one. I'll grab some more gold, I think, maybe two, or coal. Don't even have to use any of the food buffs. We still got that speed buff on. Oh, oh. Oh, little piece there. Oh, it popped. Okay. A little copper. Oh. Oh, that popped good. That pop, man, they're popping good too. Gonna stay out of that water. This, these are that's two nodes stacked. At least it looked like two to me. Maybe not. Well, we're just moving along. Okay, is that really? Sometimes there's stuff stuck on the ceiling. Slowly scan. We got platinum that we're not ready for. Our buffs just ran out. Well, we should be preemptive though. All of them ran out, yeah. Let's try the new stuff. Just won't do the speed one. Oh, there is. Oh, we got gold and uh, coal. Did I get it all? 
As much as we can. Oh, whoa! Dang, it's like the stuff just coming back. <laughs> now I'm gonna be overweight. I think we're all right. Sweet. Keep, keep on, keeping on. You know, it's fun when you level when you're not trying. You know, when you're just doing the normal gameplay. This is just one of the things I liked about the game that, I, you know, I don't have to go hunt. And, you know, I don't have to do that. I could level just from playing as a builder, just building and mining and so forth. So anyway, but yeah, we're down to like a platinum. Is that it? That's it. There's one platinum node in here. Oh, come on. Seriously. Now let's get outside. You hear that noise? See that little bird noise? That's not, a, that's not anything that I know of in the game. We're gonna take the antibiotic, get rid of the cave sickness, get our bow back. And we're gonna head home for speed and accuracy. There we go. Well, I'm glad I stopped there. I thought I thought I'd emptied it, but. That goes back to when I explained to you guys that I had several starts. <laughs> and I had probably emptied that cave out twice previously when practicing. Okay, I think we gotta go down here. Oh, we gotta be careful. Oh, it's kinda steep. Here's where I use the stealth on, stealth off, stealth on, stealth off. There we go. There we go. Home sweet home. I'm gonna get lazy and end up with like five bridges. Oh, that one's too far. I was trying to use, like here you see, I was trying to use the natural areas. Of course, this is also where the animals go to drink. <laughs> Maybe I should have picked the more difficult spots. Like that one, they don't bother that one. Now let's check on this. Holy crap. What do we learn here? Modifiers, something with a shovel and sun. Now someone told me to go. I don't think this tells me what I want to know. They said go in there and look for the, what it is you're trying to figure out on the different buffs and stuff. See, like we have, uh, okay, the reinforced Railing, ladders, door, trap door. Yeah, really, they really did a good job with this. I just haven't had a chance to break it down, but it lets you really see everything. Like, here's the different suits and the modules for the suits. So here's my favorite suit, at least early game. So you can see, you don't have to keep trying to go up there and find out stuff. Because that tells you where you buy it at. Okay. Yeah, that's the one we're working up to, but I may get some other stuff before then. Some tools and a backpack. So that we can drop down. Okay, we got ores, so let's go in here. You know, I'm gonna be working on night lights later. At least we'll put some stuff up soon. Got a good supply of coal. Even our gold's starting to pile up. Yeah, I'll start thinking about how I want to lay this out. I'll get rid of that fireplace. I really think I'm going to open this up. So I'm not going to... I'm going to move the wall in probably two, I think. And then turn this into an open, covered workshop area for later on. So we'll see. It may be a bad idea. I don't know. I guess I can wait till I get the actual workbenches. Oh, I forgot about this. Let's get you inside. Oh, might as well take that. We'll go to bed here in a minute. Let's salt up the good stuff. When I say good stuff, now we're kind of 
I still like it for that attack speed, though. Or, or the melee swing speed. So we'll hold on to that. It's got its uses. Did I salt? Keeping some of this for, you know, emergency. In case I run out of food. Not likely, but I'm going to split that in half. There we go. Well, we've been, how long have we been since? Yeah, we've only used one piece of ice. So that's good to see. We're all stacked here. Let's put the poison in here. I call it spoiled meat. Okay. Get the fire going. Well, it doesn't light up very far, does it? I get spoiled by that damn lantern. Check our stats. Need a little bit of water. We'll drink from the filter. And I hate to keep repairing this hammer uh, pick. But if we run into a good mine, yeah, it'll last long enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we picked up enough to, to fill us up. Okay. Go back to the map. Now we're going here. I want to go check it out again. Let me go check on this. I'm assuming it, yeah, it's not tall enough yet. Is there total speed 120%? Oh, here we go. So a little under half or under half. So good. Oh, damn horses again. Dude, you're wrecking my deal. Okay, I need to go that way anyway. There he goes. So we do have uh, six blueprint points. I'm going to hold on to those. Oh, we got two solo and six talent. When we get to the cave, I'm going to look at those. I've been trying to finish off the combat for my bow. And then I want to start looking at the couple of other areas. I do want to have a little bit of points in the farming. And I, I am aware someone told me, hey, you know, you only have you only have 90 points. And I, I believe me, I know. Um, so I'm going to be a jack of all trades and, you know, specialist and none kind of thing where I'll be probably 15 to 20 points is the most you'll see maybe the bow will be the only one I might get a little further into but even then I don't worry about any of the weird I say weird any of the specialty or it has some stuff like aim shot or whatever it's called it has a couple of bleed I don't worry about those I try to just go for the core stuff like increased damage increased uh Crit criticals. Uh, it was there wasn't one that res, that re involves aim or not aiming, but you'll see. Let's look at it here in a second when we get to the cave. Another good area to hunt. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see. We put down eight plots. Those are the simple dirt plots. And that is tier one. You can start you can start planting food as soon as you get the wood shovel in your hand. You can start making those little plots. And it's pretty cool. I like that they didn't... It used to be all that stuff. You know, you have to be way up there. So that rolls, rolls back to the missions because I could drop planet side and say I want... There's certain foods I want for buffs. I could drop planet side, bring the seeds with me, just to like say squash. And I know I'm dropping here and I don't have squash, but I want that food. Just bring some seeds down with me, get a little base going, build a couple tables, plant those. You know, that way I'd have time to gear up. Ooh, we gotta, we definitely haven't been here unless it resealed itself. Well, now that, see, now it's coming back to bite me in the butt that I decided not to fix the 
axe or the pickaxe. <laughs> I'm gonna go right now. I think I'm okay. Well, usually what I'll do is just stand straight here and go forward until it stops swinging. There we go. I'll move down. There we go. Put a little light on the subject. So this has like a little step here, yeah. Okay, so let's go over here a little bit. Another good uh, comment, suggestion, or I guess tip. When you're making these cave entrances, and this really applies for the more dangerous areas, keep it just big enough for you, your body to squeeze through, and that way if you need to hide, like run from a bear, they can't fit through here normally, some of the bigger animals. I'm not worried about it in particular because there's no bears in this area or anything that I'm too afraid of. Okay. How's that look? We're down 50% probably on the pickaxe. It's okay. How much ore do we have? 172. Actually, let me see if I can get that right on 100. Another batch. 176. 180. 186. 190. Come on. Oh, you're going to go right over, aren't you? 200. Look at that. Like I planned it. Okay, max that out. That way we can come back later and get these if we need them. Okay, we got our torch, lantern on. So we have not been here yet. This is a pretty big cave, actually. So let's do a clean out. This could be six to eight worms, I think. Gotta get headshots. They're back to back there. Made it a little difficult. Give him a chance to look at that node. That's going to be one that you can't get all of. <laughs> now we're probably going to have one right there. I think I see a little bit of a, like, you can, they have like a little stuck on a rock. You know? The little outcropping they make when they appear. Maybe not. He's going to wait and ambush me. I don't see him. Oh! Damn, I didn't see him for a second. Hmm. Not really going to get a good shot from here. There we go. There we go. Now that might be a trick. I don't want to go over there just yet. Let's go up here for a second. I say a trick, but a trap. Because it's deep water there, yeah. Whoa! There's another one back there somewhere. I'm stuck. You got him. I mean, I get all these arrows back. <laughs> Go two more. Well, not all of them back, but some of them. Back. Doesn't look too bad though. Is that a deep, deep ore? It is. It's a weird spot. What is it anyway? Um, Silica, okay. Yeah, there's a ton of material in here. I think we're good. There still might be one over here. I 
Oh! Somebody clipped that one. That was a nice jumping. I was jumping out of the water. <laughs> uh, I'm not good at clipping stuff. So. All right. Put two hits there. I'm going to concentrate on iron. Because that's what we need the most of. Oh! Totally forgot, guys. Damn. Let's go to talents solo. Because um, I already got that one. Okay, yeah, we got the plus 10%. This is carry weights of all materials. Minus 20%. Boom. There we go. So between that and the backpack. I think I'm going to hold off till I can read through some of these. That's strength. That's good. We can get a couple extra layered levels of damage. Food buffs. 10%. Okay. Yeah. And we're starting to fill these in. I don't know that I'm going to worry about like foraging. Yield from butchering, because you see how much we're getting now. And what is this? Yeah, this is. I'm not worried about these. I get enough material. Now this one could be useful, but I don't know. I'm leveling fast enough, I feel. But that might be nice. Reduced carry weights on on the on the built items. That's, that helps you out when you're building. But we'll probably start loading up here with speed and. Oh, in fact, I know that. Yeah, let's start loading up on health and speed. And let's go back to regular talents over to combat. I was trying to work down this tree a little more. It's kind of tricky, but here I was going to go plus 15 accuracy. And then I want to get plus 5 critical. Let's see, I don't care about this. I don't care about anything in here. I don't think. That's just a chance to slow them down. Now this one... I think I have to unlock that one to get here because I want to get these two together. That's plus what is it, 25 plus another 15 on critical damage. And then I'm not really worried about homing instinct or pinning shot. Yeah. So I'm going to do one point here. Get that. Get that. Get that. So now we've got the extra damage and I may still put a little more in here, but then we'll be done. Later on, I could may consider some of this helps you because you can reduce your cost or like here you'll get double the arrows. But I find the crafting is not a problem for me, you know, because I like that part of the game. I like I like gathering materials and stuff. So some of this will be instinct if we need it. And some of this speeds up some stuff like how fast you draw the bow, you know, how fast all that happens. So right now, I, I, yeah, I wouldn't mind getting a little faster on that. So, anyway, let's get back. Iron, iron, iron. The good thing is we lowered the carry weight. So now I should be able to carry a lot more. Go to inventory. Yeah, we should be able to carry a lot more now. Look at that. Back to back here. Is there a third one over here? No. Uh, a little rainstorm. Oh, 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 oh. Let's just take a look. I'd like to pop it if I can get the extra. Not always possible. I see one up here though. Or, or is that platinum, copper, copper? Hang on. Get back up here. No, that's not iron. Okay. Let's get on top of here. On top of here. Ugh, come on. You can make it. It's a little patient sometimes. And a lot of luck, I think. Oh, oh, out of water. Hang on. There 
There we go. Just need that little thirst boost. Yeah, that's... Oh, there's some right there. I jumped all the way up here. But there's nothing up here, right? All right, let's go back. Get the one on the edge. Oh, I'm right on top of it. I went stealth to keep me from hopefully falling off. Yeah. It can save you a lot of times. Oh, now there is one up there. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Didn't want to do that. You get cold, get the debuff there, then a chance to get sick. Come on. There we go. Ooh, lucky strike. It's a good timing on that one. Okay, that's another titanium. Just to see how much we walk out with that like carry weight. Another good one, suggestion, tip, I should say. Ooh, look at that one. Is um, when you're doing a big cave like this, especially if you're, you know, if you got the time, uh, you can go ahead and set up out front. Go ahead and put in a, uh, make yourself a, uh, the smelter furnace piece and bring it with you and just drop it in the front with some coal you can usually find some here and you can start smelting the bars down the bars do weigh less part of it is because it takes two ore to make one bar so you could process a lot of it and you'd be able to get out of here with a lot more okay here i gotta let me see something i brought these but yeah that's gonna be difficult i think so we're gonna go 45 the only thing I don't like about these like, is they're always facing the opposite direction from what I want to do. Sometimes it's hard to judge the angle. I don't know if that's going to be high enough. Uh, let's see. Uh oh, oh, the coal's in the way. All right, not a big deal. Let me get this out of here. You can also do platforms and make yourself a little... Uh, I may do that later. we got plenty of other material here. To worry about. Oh, I just jumped off. Come on. get up I'm trying to get up here and then jump up here in that corner there we go all right and this would be a good time to talk about cave dwellings are good or when you're doing this stuff a lot of people are everybody even me i skip it all the time but because it's only one point now, you can easily start using thatch. It's great in here because you don't have to chop a tree down or anything. You just run out there, hit a bunch of the little, you know, some of the saplings and uh, grab up some, you know, the, just picking plants out front real quick and get enough material. And then you can build you enough stuff to get, you know, to, tran to climb up where you need to go. Just a suggestion. That's about the only use they have. <laughs> oh, look at that's a dual, another dual one. Now this one will be funny because I can't break that. Oh, we got it. Okay, yeah, because we can't break the other stuff. Oh, we got gold here too. So we got two deep mining ores. We have the silica back there, and we got gold. That's a good one, gold. Another lucky strike. 
I'm sure there's a lot of stuff I'm not seeing just yet. But we're going to concentrate, like I said, iron. This is going to be a pretty good haul. Gonna stay up here, look around. What time is it? 12? It was only noon? Or is that, didn't I start? I think I, think I started at night. It wasn't morning, I don't remember. Having too much fun, lose track of time. Keep an eye on that weight. Inventory, inventory. Oh, and food's down low. Okay, let's grab that before it spoils. Oh, all my buffs ran out. Okay. All right, let's not push it. We're at 169 out of 173. Good. <laughs> oh, big middle finger. Here, let me give you some cave lung before you leave. Thank you. Well, you know what, buddy? I'm prepared for that. Cool. Glad I made it. Okay, we're out. Get back to base. We'll see if our uh, corn has survived the storm. There was a storm, wasn't there? There's some more bees. And I did look through the, uh, we can build beehives, our uh, houses, I guess you call them. There's a lot of new stuff in the, in the crafting blueprint menus. They almost need to break it into a tier five now because, you know, spread some stuff out maybe because there's so much stuff in there. <laughs> and some of it, I don't know, it's because they're just trying to release stuff. But like the B stuff is all, whoa. Okay, I hope this doesn't get me in trouble. Okay, whoosh. <laughs> I don't want to fall through the world. Oh, that hurt. No, we didn't get a sprain. Uh, yeah, so like the B, the B stuff is all in one tier all together, but it has like four or five devices, uh, buildings or something like that. So, you know, normally it would be like tier one, you get a basic thing, tier two, you get the next level stuff. So they just kind of, right now anyway, it's all put together. Any horses? Nope. That was a good run, guys. That's a lot of good good material. Ooh, that corn's looking good. We'll check it here in a second. I can't afford to pick anything up. Okay, put that away. Let's get that in. Ooh, am I got room? Um, that was a lot of ore, really. Okay. Uh, we have a... There we go. Look at that. Like like I planned it, man. Should have just said, yeah, this cabinet's for the ore. <laughs> All right, let's go check the farming before we end it. We're we're actually, I just realized we're another, at the end of another episode already. Man, things are just flying by. You think these are ready? Press to ones. No, I guess not. So it says press, to, they're not tall enough, right? Some of them have more progress than others. Hmm. They look dry too. Oh, let me go grab my water can. Did I leave it in here? No, I think I put it in the farming box. I gotta make sure I don't, yeah. This is how you lose tools. Yeah, eventually when we get the stuff built out here, I'll put a cabinet just for greenhouse stuff. Okay, number seven. Okay, let's make sure I read it at the right. Eat a fill. I don't want to drink it. And then provide water. Well, 
my pickaxe is almost broken. Yeah, I'm guessing. See, that looks okay. So we're getting there. Each one's a separate plot. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they all look like they got the same. I don't know what I was seeing earlier. See, that says growth prop progress doesn't match. Here, it's almost done. So they'll be ready for us next episode. Looks like be a good start. All right, guys. That time again. If you're enjoying the series, please like and subscribe. If you have any comments, questions, tips, or tricks, please drop those down below. Uh, for myself and the community, we all appreciate it. we got a lot of new players here that are enjoying the game as well. And until next time, Madstone out.